Hi everybody, it's Amber in Key West, in my office. Key West is outside, out the window there. It's cloudy today though. And um, I like doing videos from in my office because it's really hot out. I know you guys probably want to see the beach and the palm trees. If there wasn't such a glare, you could see palm trees out there. But I'll get out there eventually, I promise, I promise. Even though I don't like the, the sun and the beach and bathing suits anymore. But anyways, I'm just going to tell you a little bit about myself. I am 47, I think. I have a beautiful 12-year-old daughter and a wonderful husband who works full-time for uh, a local big giant phone company. Works very hard, very, very hard. We live pretty much paycheck to paycheck. I'm co-owner in a family business here in Key West, which is an advertising, sales, and marketing company. And... It's a great job. It has a lot of perks. It pays for my car. I get some advertising trade for some restaurants. I get a weekly salary, a small weekly salary, um, just because, I don't know, that's how it is. But I have a great life. I live in a beautiful new house that we purchased this year, and I have a great car. I live in paradise on an island. I have good jewelry. Everything is great. The only thing missing is the ability to be able to have financial freedom. Um, I love to go to lunch and hang out with friends and go shopping and I'd love to be able to travel. I'd really love to be able to go to the Empower Network events and you know all the ones that they have every year and um, be able to meet people and help people. I, I would just love to be able to do that. And I always, <laughs> I keep saying, I'd love to be able to go on vacation besides Disney World because living in Key West, Disney World is actually the, the most affordable vacation we can do every year. Actually, almost twice a year we go. Um, we can drive there, take seven hours, and we can rent a condo, and we know how to do the whole Disney thing. And I want to go beyond Disney World. I know everybody else wants to go to Disney World, but I don't. I'm done with Disney World. So I just wanted to tell you a little bit about myself. And um, I joined Empower Network 32 days ago. I'm going to help you learn how to do it, whether you should do it, tell you everything I did. I've not made any money yet. I, I don't even have a lead yet, okay? So I'm a baby. I have gone balls out though and really set myself up. I've set up my blog. I set up my own website, which is amberkeywest.com. I did that because you can't post Empower Network links on Facebook right now. Um, it's blocked, which was kind of suspicious to me when I first started. And um, I guess it maybe has to do with a lot of spamming since everybody's a marketer. So you have to go through something called social media bar or a couple other options. So I've been, I was skeptical at first, you know, but after I watched a friend of mine who's in it and saw how much she was growing just in her personal development, that really, 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 really changed my mind. It wasn't even, you know, uh, she wasn't even, I don't even know if she's making money or not, but she's changed so much for, you know, and really developed her, her skills that it was so attractive to me. So that's why I signed up. That's why I'm doing it. I definitely hope to be able to, you know, make uh, a better income so I can do a whole lot more in my life with, with my family and friends. And uh, I'd love to be able to meet meet you guys. I am going to the Orlando event um, at the end of October, and I heard that those really are life changing. So I'm, I bought my ticket the first day I signed up for Empower Network. I'm willing to do whatever it takes. I've been following every single suggestion, and we'll see how it goes for me. I'll let you know my progress. So like and share this video if you know anyone who's, you know, wondering what the hell Empower Network is. It's very obscure and kind of hard to get the gist of it. It's really even harder to explain. It's kind of something different for everybody depending on what you want it to be and how much you're ready to commit, the willingness that you have, the open-mindedness that you have um, to take suggestions. And then I think you can take it as far as you want or not. The most you have to lose is $25, which is what it costs to sign up in the first place. And you can cancel that at any time. So for me, it was worth it to give it a try. So I'm just about to go all in this week. If you don't know what that means, just stay tuned. And I'll talk to you soon. All right. Love you guys. Bye. Oh, yeah. Share this video. Bye.